it's, it's still pretty cool to see it. Very cool really to see. Cool. She will be standing on the shoulders of giants. We're talking about the new Lady Vols head basketball coach. This is Coach Kim Caldwell getting acquainted, as you saw there, with the statue of Pat Summit on the UT campus. And this news breaking over the weekend. The new head coach comes on the heels of former coach Kelly Harper's dismissal just one week ago. Social media is a buzz about that coach in her mid 30s who was taking on a major job in college athletics. Fans posting online their support. 10 Sports Emily Ray Cochran joining us from our big BAM to tell us more about what this means for the program. Hey, Emily Ray. Thanks, John. The Lady Vols have their new head coach and you've said it. She's here. She's hopping off a plane. That was on Sunday. The University of Tennessee confirmed Marshall's Kim Caldwell will take over the legendary women's basketball program after former head coach Kelly Harper was fired a week ago. Athletic director Danny White said Kim has a winning formula and she has upheld that winning formula at each of her coaching stops. She's only had two and by the numbers, her history of winning and turning around programs is actually quite impressive. If we take a look at these numbers, overall record 217 to 31. She's only lost 31 games in her eight years of coaching, seven conference titles, five conference tournament championships, eight NCAA tournament appearances in D1 and D2. She's implementing what that winning formula means and every year she's been a head coach, she's made it a winning mentality. And that is why we look at what she's paying, what she's getting paid by the school, the buyout. UT paid 600,000 to get her to Rocky Top. Her base pay is set at 750,000 on a five-year contract that's worth 3.75 million. For reference, Kelly Harper's base pay was 1.1 million. Now the interesting part is there are incentives for the success she could achieve as a head coach at Tennessee. For example, if the Lady Vols simply make it to the NCAA tournament, which they have never missed, she would net $25,000. If they make a Final Four run, $150,000. And of course, the in-between rounds net a particular amount as well. So here's the most interesting part. The contract says if Caldwell leads the Lady Vols to a national title, she would get a raise that would equal or exceed the highest salary of any head coach of women's basketball in the Division I category. That would put her at over $3 million, which would make her the highest paid women's basketball coach. Of course, these are all ifs, but super interesting to see what UT is willing to pay her if she does have that success in her first year. Coming up at 6, we will discuss whether or not her winning record can be sustainable at a level as high as the SEC. John?